Hi, my name is Pavel Spechalski and do you know that in 40-something days some of the GPS modules we are using in our RC hobby might just stop working? Yep. Who is old enough to remember something that was called year 2K problem? Um, in the, when we changed the millennium from uh, second millennium to the third millennium, year 2000, there was... Uh, some systems were using only two digits to encode years and there was um, a fear that because of that uh, and when we go from 99 to 00, zero some of the system might go crazy. Now, in exactly 6th of the April 2019, we might have something very, very similar, but connected only to GPS modules. This is how it goes. GPS modules and GPS positioning, global positioning systems, work because they measure time differences. If you know the time differences and the speed of propagation, you can measure distance uh, from the source of the signal and when you know where the source of the signal is, if you have enough sources, you can triangulate your current position. This is how it works. Each GPS module computes the time difference and the distance difference from you and the satellites. And to do this, it has to know the exact timestamp, the exact UTC timestamp. And there is, let's say, a problem with the GPS um, protocol as it goes, because it encodes weak number using 10 bits. 10 bits, that means that can be only to 1024 weeks in the epoch. Epoch? I think this is called the epoch. That means that when the GPS first started in the 80s, the first epoch ended in 1999. Of course, the number of modules were smaller, probably no one even noticed, but then the China exploded. And on the 6th of the April 2019, we are going into end of the second epoch. We're going to roll over the weak number from the 1023 to zero. The question is, the question is how each separate module will react to this situation. <sighs> Unfortunately, nobody really knows. If you are using really like the good quality and kind of expensive and bought from official resellers, modules manufactured in the last few years, probably, probably the firmware inside of the module is already aware of the situation that after 2000, no, 1023, there will be a zero week and everything will be just fine. But if you have a very long module, closer to 20 years, is it really possible? Oh, you have just cheap China knockoff of the whatever that goes with unknown, absolutely unknown version of the firmware. Think might got, think might go actually unknown because we don't know what will happen. The module definitely, if this will react in the wrong way for the weak rollover, um, might well not get a fix. If it will be working, uh, some strange positions might be uh, reported by it. Nobody really knows. What you can do? If this is only an RC situation, don't fly between 6th and 7th when the rollover will be happening. And if the GPS module is still working correctly on the 7th of April, you're fine. You don't have to do anything. If the module will not be working, then probably you will have to get yourself a new one. Right now, if you got something from China, the no, chances of getting a checked and approved and really verified firmware uploaded to this module are rather slim pickings and this will not happen. But after 6th of April, you're fine. You do not have to do anything. Get to one. Like I said, probably the new ones are fine, but nobody really knows how it's working. What with INAF? Can uh, INAF and us as INAF developers do anything about this to prevent this from happening? Yes and no. We will not probably proactively do anything until 6th of April because we don't know the scale. There is no way to test it before the 6th of April because we cannot simulate what the satellites uh, in the sky are really 
sending to the module, so we will not. If you are using NMA or MTK protocol to communicate INAV, then I'm sorry, we cannot probably do anything. There is a chance, if there will be a lot of problems with the most popular modules and you are using the Ublox protocol, there is a chance we might be able to do something. But only then. Only then and still only if your this will be like a severe scale because, um, like I said, there is no way really to test and it, the developer does not have a unit that failed. He cannot like, reproduce and, and this is like, this is not how software development works. So beware, 6th of April, probably nothing will happen. If anything will happen, then uh, those thing are, things are not really that expensive. So maybe it's time to update very old GPS modules. Okay, who knows? You've been warned. That's all for today. Until the next one. Bye bye.